what's up everybody welcome back to bayou bandit charters it is getting that time of year water temperature is warming up we're sitting on about 62 to 63 degrees time to bring out the old dirty boxers and target flounder yes flounder i believe my beloved flounder may be showing back up it's a couple of weeks early but we i can't take it any longer y'all i got to do some scouting we're gonna be throwing in the shallows hoping to get some flounder that have moved back in if y'all have a passion for saltwater fishing like i do hit that subscribe button give this video a like enough talking let's get out here and see if we can catch some flounder when you're flounder fishing you want to throw parallel to the shoreline get as close to that flooded grass as you can because flounder love nosing up against that grass so they're going to be tight to that grass and that's where you want to be fishing fish on fish on first flounder first flounder all right we're gonna boat flip him looks like we got him hooked pretty good there we go all right the old fish bite dirty boxer did it again look at that guy right there he is a 15 inch flounder definitely a legal fish we will be keeping fish today we are going to put that guy in the box old flounder are starting to move back in man that did not take long at all nice flounder sitting about 15 inches let's see if we can get some more man how i have missed my flounder so good to see them coming back in and a couple of weeks early we've got an incoming tide stained water we've had a ton of rain over the past couple of weeks but man is it good to see the flounder coming back got my dad fishing with me today <laughs> he had the opportunity to come and go with me we're just out having a good time this afternoon pretty day pretty day a little windy but it's pretty Here we go, here we go. Oh, I missed him. That was a fish. That was definitely a fish. Bit my tail off. That was flounder. <laughs> there you go. Throw a couple of times. There he is. There he is. There we go. There we go. Another flounder. Another flounder. All right. About the same size as the last one. Maybe a little bit smaller. Yeah, we're probably going to let that guy go. But my God, did that thing thump it, boy. Whoo, I miss feeling that thump from those flounder. Whoo, yeah. Oh yeah. All right, let's get a measurement on him. Another 15 inch flounder. 
15 and a quarter. Woo, look at there, look at there. They're back, y'all. They are back. Got to get the pliers to him. Man, come on, come on. Let go of my dirty boxer. There we go. Another nice spring flounder going in the box. Actually, we're putting them in the live well. I put both of those fish in the live well. Depending on how we do, I may tag them and release them. I may keep them. Hadn't decided yet, y'all. I believe I got an oyster. It's pulling like an oyster. Yeah, that flounder I had just caught, he had got a hold of the tail. I set the hook a little early and he took my tail off my dirty boxer. Put a new one on there, threw right back over there and caught that rascal. Seeing a lot of little glass minnows, a lot of bait. That is a good sign. Now flounder love structure. They love getting around dock piling, stuff like that. If you can get over there close to areas like that, good chance you can get a flounder. I got the poles down, stop right here and fish this area, fan cast this area right here pretty good. Well, we have got in here out of this wind and them no see -ums is eating up on me. Look at them on my hands. If y'all hadn't tried this product, it's all natural, deep free, made by Hawk Soap Company. They have Skeeter Hawk and they have Marsh Romance. Both work really, really good. I do not ever come out on the water without it. Check them out. I've got a discount link down in the description below. Save you 15%. It's good products, good for kids. It doesn't have that deed in it. So you're not spraying poison on yourself. I'll give it a try. Here we go. Here we go. There we go. There he is. <laughs> Flounder number three. Oh, he's a little guy. But a flounder, none the less. Boat flip that guy. There we go. This one will get tagged and released. He's sitting on closed mouth, 13 inches. He is a legal fish in the state of Mississippi, but we are going to tag this guy and let him go good hook set right through that top gill plate. That is what you want to see. Come here, boy. I'm fixing to let you go. Hang on. Give you a little bit of jewelry first. All right got some jewelry my fishing pliers are in the dry box so we're going to use the old leatherman there we go all right little guy thank you for the fight see you dude all right, y'all, I am super excited that my beloved flounder are back in. By the time y'all see the video, they'll be in. 
in pretty good numbers. It's still a little early. Can't believe I actually caught three legal size flounder. Uh, it's, it's the time of the year, y'all. Water temperature is on the rise. It's sitting on about 63 degrees, almost to that magic number. If you're not familiar why I tagged that flounder, I am in the tagging program from the University of South Alabama and Dolphin Island Sea Lab. If you do catch one of the flounder I have tagged, record the number and copy down the website. When you get home, submit that number and you'll receive a prize package from Fish Bites, from me, and from the University of South Alabama. It's a great program to track these flounder, see how much they have grown. Flounder grow super, super fast. It's amazing to see how quick they grow and where they move to. Uh, good research headed up by Dylan Keene. Dolphin Island Sea Lab plays a great big, big role in this program. I've got a full video with Dylan fishing with me at the end of last summer. I'll leave the video link at the end of this video check it out full of information about growth rates and captures and how far they travel ton of information we decided to go ahead and release these guys give him a little tag all right dude see ya That should be 6-2. All right, dude. See ya. All right, we're fixing to wrap this video up. Didn't have long to fish this afternoon. Able to catch those three flounder. But hope y'all enjoyed the video. Like and subscribe if y'all hadn't already. And if you want to go on a flounder gigging charter with me, I run trips every Friday and Saturday night year round flounder gigging along the Alabama and Mississippi Gulf Coast. Be sure to check out the description below. My website link is in there or give me a call right here 251-465-1598 and we'll get you booked on one of these awesome awesome flounder gigging charters. And if you didn't get to see me in a bayou you can see me right here on Bayou Bandit Charters every Sunday morning nine o'clock. See y'all next week.